In this tutorial, we're going to look at a great little piece of software called MPEG Stream Clip. And here's what MPEG Stream Clip is useful for. I've had people that have come to me in the past and they're looking to uh, capture footage from a DVD or from a website because they want to utilize it for their own purposes, whether they need to edit it or they need to uh, grab some files off of the DVD for uploading to YouTube or, or uh, other shared video hosting sites. Well, MPEG Stream Clip is a great way to do this, and it's a free piece of software from Squared5. Uh, here's the web address up here, squared5.com. And, and when you download it, you pop in your DVD, go to File, and you're going to want to open your DVD. Every DVD that's burned comes with a video TS folder. So if we scroll and uh, go through here and open up our DVD, we see we have a video TS folder. Every DVD that's burned, duplicated, replicated, will have a video TS folder. So we open that folder, and what it does is MPEG Stream Clip will then load that information from the DVD into this window right here. And once it's there, we can then convert it to a format that's suitable for any, almost any purpose. For editing, for uh, uploading to video hosting sites, uh, emailing, sharing, just whatever you'd like to do with it. So I'm just kind of scrubbing through here. And you see here that you can even, down here at the bottom, you could trim the clip, you could trim the endpoint, trim the out point. So you don't have to, you don't have to render uh, the whole video if you don't need to, if you just need a small segment. And this is very helpful because what you're doing is you're retaining the digital properties of this video file. Um, if you were to just capture this from your DVD deck and you popped the disc in and you captured uh, through that to your computer, uh, most likely you're going to be hooked up via an analog RCA signal and you're going to have some, some quality loss, some quality degradation there. Um, albeit it'll be a small uh, small quality loss but it'll be lost nonetheless and, it, and it'll probably be noticeable. Here you have a lot more flexibility inside MPEG Stream Clip and you see this is just a project that I completed for a client recently. Once it's loaded go to File and then you have all these different export options QuickTime, DV, AVI, MPEG4 uh, different formats they offer even more possibilities exporting just the audio but let's say I just wanted to export a QuickTime file for use uh, in editing or uploading to another uh, shared hosting site. We have different codecs we can choose from, a lot of different options here, different frame sizes. I would want to pick 720 by 480 if I was going to use this in editing. Uh, if I was going to upload it to the web, I'd probably want to use 640 by 480. That's more of a web-friendly uh, frame size. And then once you have all your settings the way you like it, you just create the movie by clicking this Make Movie button down here at the bottom right. What's also neat about MPEG Stream Clip is you can also save your settings as different presets. So whatever you're going to be using your video for in different situations, you can save these presets so you can quickly uh, bring them back up to, to the front of your menu. Uh, you notice that you can also select between 1080i and 720p, which is great. Uh, this came in very handy during a recent client project. I'm just going to click cancel here. But this project here that I've loaded in MPEG Stream Clip was done for uh, a recent client. And they had some existing footage that they wanted to include in the video. They had an old DVD. Uh, I'm going to scroll through here, right here. Uh, you see that there uh, was some computer animated right in here. Uh, there was some computer animated uh, elements that they already had on DVD and they wanted to repurpose those elements into this video we completed and all they had was a DVD they didn't have any of the raw the raw footage what we were able to do is load that DVD into our system use MPEG stream clip and we were able to pull uh, this footage out in a 720p format which matched the format of our uh, of our project of the raw footage that we were shooting and it blended seamlessly with the rest of the project. So MPEG Stream Clip is a great tool, very useful for uh, getting video files off of DVDs, off of the web, um, and converting them to a format that, uh, that's most useful for your needs.